All right, right here, what we got us a snapper turtle. This is a snapper turtle. A snapper turtle can live to be like 47 years old. It can get up to like, uh, it can get up to like about uh, 35 pounds in normal size. But they have been known to record one in the state of Virginia to get up to 51 pounds. Now, snapper turtle will fucking bite your fingers off and shit. You don't want to fuck with them. Do not pick him up by his tail. Because you can fuck his spine up. We're going to demonstrate now what a snapping turtle can do to an apple. Now we're going to demonstrate what a snapping turtle can do to an apple on a piece of rebar. God. God. Yeah. <laughs> Imagine that's your finger. Yeah. Notice I'm not hurting the snapper turtle or fucking up the snapper turtle. See how he can extend his neck and jam and take a chunk out of your ass. Snapper turtle can be like uh can be like up to 19 inches. This is a this is just what they used to call a common snapper turtle in the state of Virginia. And uh that's right. You can cook this turtle. And a good way to clean him and to separate his skin and shit, you can roll him over on his back. And fucking cut a little slit by his uh by his arm. And insert a fucking air nozzle in that motherfucker. And blow him up, inflate that bitch, and it will separate his skin from his fucking uh from his meat. Now, whenever you're gonna fucking cook a snapping turtle, you gotta parboil that motherfucker. You're gonna have to parboil him and shit until he's like fork tender. Like if you wanna make some fried snapping turtle, you parboil that fucking snapping turtle until he's like fork tender. Then roll him up in some flour and fry that bitch like he's fucking like a regular piece of fried chicken. You know what I'm saying? Or I've heard of some people taking and frying them up. And wrapping it up in full and putting it in the fucking oven and cooking it on 350 for about fucking an hour. Other recipes would be like crock pot turtle. Crock pot turtle where you fucking take and put some peppers and some onions in the bottom of your crock pot. Lay your fucking turtle down in that motherfucker after you done cleaned him off. And put him some chicken stock up over top of him and cook him on low for fucking eight, eight hours. Seven to eight hours and shit in your crock pot. You might also fucking like you heard of sawmill gravy or sausage gravy. They got turk, they got fucking snapper turtle gravy and fucking you serve that over rice. There's fucking other recipes like turtle creole, turtle soup, turtle stew, turtle tacos. You can cook your motherfucker on the grill and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? Snapper turtle on the grill, barbecue turtle. There's all kinds of fucking recipes that fucking make with your snapper turtle <laughs> and shit. Also, I'd like to say that the fucking snapping turtle will eat any fucking thing he can subdue or kill. He will fucking eat a muskrat, a fucking duck, a goose, a fucking fish, a catfish, a bullfrog, beetles, flies, fucking snakes, anything that fucking moves, the motherfucker will eat that shit. He lives down in the swamp in the water. They're all in the waterways all around this motherfucker. They also, they mate in the springtime. And they lay their eggs in a hole and cover it up with dirt. And it takes about 75 to 85 days for the eggs to fucking come out and hatch. And then this motherfucker right here, if you're not careful, will bite you. If you notice, he got a long snout that overhangs on the front of his head and claws on his feet. Look at this. Do not put your hands near his mouth. He will follow that apple. <laughs> Just like that. He'll fuck you up. And shit. Now, now, I've had a lot of fried snapper turtle in my life. It's got seven different flavors of meat. It's like, it's like a turkey, dog meat, white meat, different flavors of meat and shit. Snapper turtle, if cooked right, it's really good. You can also take his guts and his organs after you clean them. And use them for fucking chum, for fucking fishing, for catfish. Do not punch his gallbladder or his liver and let bile seep over onto his fucking meat. When you're cleaning him, it will make the meat taste bitter. Now, 
we're gonna fucking put our camera on the end of a selfie stick up close to his mouth and see if you can see what it would look like. Notice how he snapped it at the camera and shit. <laughs> yeah. Now I'm not going to actually eat this turtle. I'm going to let him go. Right, put the camera up into his mouth. <laughs> that was him striking the camera. We're not going to do that again because I'm going to have to go get a new camera. Anything else I can fucking say about a catfish? I mean, a, a, a snapper turtle, as you notice, he's got this fucking bitch looks pretty prehistoric. he got spikes on the end of his tail and shit. Uh, there's two different kinds of fucking snapping turtles. They got this kind of snapper turtle and they got the alligator snapper turtle that's more up size and shit. The male snapper turtle gets bigger than the female snapping turtle. If you want to catch snapping turtles... The best way to catch a snapping turtle is to get you a big old fucking turtle hook and go out the lily pads in the pond and starve a piece of stick down in his pads and put you a hook on the end of that bitch with a bird on the end of that motherfucker or a piece of fucking fish or something and hang that shit down in the water. You come back the next day, the turtle will be hanging on the end of it. And that's how you catch your turtle and shit. It's called with, with turtle and turtle hooks. This is a pretty good size snapping turtle. Snapping turtles will come out and get fucking hit on the road and shit by cars and shit when they're going from creek to creek and traveling. I seen a video earlier of a man came out and he had a fucking snapping turtle stuck on his neck. He was noodling for a catfish and the turtle got on his neck and shit. Do not fucking noodle and let a cat a fucking turtle get stuck on your neck. He's very strong and powerful. Notice how he cannot retract into his shell like a fucking tortoise can that you see like a land tortoise. This son of a bitch is badass, ain't he, man? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Look how he walked. He started, ain't he? Yeah. Now, we just gonna go ahead and let this turtle go. And, uh, and respect him because I'm too fucking lazy to fucking be fucking cutting turtle and inflating his, inflating his ass and cooking him and all this other shit. I'm just going to go ahead and carry my fat ass down to the Burger King and get a Whopper. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But I have heard of motherfuckers have such thing as turtle burgers. <laughs> a turtle burger. Yeah. Yeah, imagine that shit wrapped in bacon. Huh? With cheese on that motherfucker. <laughs> you know I never did like the dark meat part of the snapping turtle. I always liked the fucking white meat of the snapping turtle. People say they're endangered. This one right here, this regular old common snapping turtle. No, there's plenty of them around. People fucking eat them all the fucking time. That bitch coming for your foot, man. And he's fast. Watch the man. Go watch it strike the apple one more time. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You'll fuck some shit up. That's your fucking hand right there on the end of that motherfucker. So if you like this video, subscribe to Geekgo TV. Shoot! Fuck! <laughs> Did you catch that, Steve? Yeah, I got it. Huh? I got it. I'm sorry. Hey, Nikolai, go knock on the door so Camila can come out and see the turtle. Please. She, hold on. You got to finish the video. I pause it. Let me let them go and shit, okay? Alright. <laughs> let the turtle go. So if you like this informative video on turtles, then subscribe to GitGo TV and leave a comment. And don't be putting no hateful comments and shit that I abused this fucking turtle. I did not pick him up by his tail or harm him in any way. There you go, motherfucker.
great. I just don't want to go up underneath my gazebo. <laughs> <laughs> 